don't know how much further I want to go up. Ah, extra careful. Ooh. All right, here we go. Getting windy. We're visiting one of the most spiritual places on Earth. This is an electromagnetic vortex. This vortex gives off very intense energy and strengthens all three parts of spiritual being. I don't know what that means, but we're gonna find out. So it's raining soon. Katie's gonna hold back, but I gotta film this video. Rain is coming any minute. We are hiking to the top. She's wearing a pretty dress. She has shorts and hiking gear, but it's cold and it's gonna rain, so. It is raining. It's raining, she's gonna hold off. Love you. Yeah, rain is coming very soon. That's where we're going. I'm hoping we don't get caught in too much rain here. I'm excited for this though. We have to make it up there. It's getting windy. This is what we like. Oh, this is crazy. Oh, there is sand in my eye. We're going to bundle up and uh, we're gonna make this happen. That's where we're going. Rain is coming down and uh, this is how we want it. Everyone's leaving. We got probably 20 minutes before it starts raining hard. Let's keep removing. So this is an electromagnetic vortex right here where some of the highest energy is. Up, up there. How do we get up there? We'll see. Wait forward. While everyone is going down, I'm going up. I haven't seen one other person come up, but uh, catching my breath, really starting to rain. But that's the, this is the fun part. We're gonna traverse up here. Step by step. I'm running up this hill. Absolutely amazing, look at this. We're not to the top yet, but we're getting there. This is fun. Everyone's going down, but I think that's a lesson to learn in life. I was telling Katie the other day, good things never happen in crowds, ever. It happens on the, by yourself, on the dirt path per se. I think that's the coolest part of this all. So, ooh, it is picking up. It's raining a little harder. We're gonna see how high we can get until I call it and say it is not safe for us anymore. So never, ever, ever wanna be put in places where it's not safe. Um, that's one thing I will not do. This is already pretty gnarly, so we'll see. We'll see how much we can push it. Let's go. I don't know how much further I want to go up. You do not want to get caught here in the rain. This turns into a water slide. But look at this view. Just sitting on the edge. Extra careful. Extra careful. Okay. I might call it. Yeah. We're calling it. Too windy, rain's coming. That was the gnarliest wind gust I've ever had. I was having rocks, rocks hit my face. I'm lucky I have my sweatshirt on because that's pretty freaky. This is a moment to just be grateful for. Oh, my lenses are so dusty. You can see the rain over there, so. We're gonna get going, rain is coming. Ah. We'll be back, but I think there's lessons in all of this that we can all take. I'll bring the adventure setup. I'll bring GoPros and stuff next time. What do I feel? 
I feel good. I just want to take a moment and breathe. Take in what's, what's around me right now. The world's noisy. There's so much going on at all times that we forget sometimes how peaceful it is to be by ourselves, be in nature, be with one other person. And that's what this whole trip with Katie and I have has been, um, just a escape from, from everything else. I'm so grateful that this is our life because this is something we've dreamed about. We've dreamed about traveling and being able to just kind of pick up where, where we're at and just go. Um, and that's what we're doing now. And this, this is an energy vortex. On, on where we are right now. I wanted to get to the top. We, we'll do another video. Uh, we'll come back uh, in a little bit. This is Bell Rock, Sedona, Arizona. Energy vortex. Very magical spiritual place. And if you just look around us, it's crazy. The amount of just history in these rocks are. And like you can see the layers, the millions and millions of years each layer represents in the rock faces. And I think that's the craziest part about all of this. And I'm just so grateful, so grateful that this, we get to experience this. And um, that's one of the things I don't think a lot of people realize. Everyone's so busy and myself included, but it's so easy to get wrapped up in what everyone else is doing. Taking a moment to just think and reflect and, and be with yourself, be with your loved ones, whatever that looks like. Do that more because we have one life. So spend it how you want to live it. Spend it with the people that you want to be with because we only have one. I think that's what this trip has, has reminded me. When I was up there, that was the scariest hiking experience I've experienced, I think. Up there, it reminded me that life is fragile. We only have one life and I'm not risking that. I'm so glad I got that video. <laughs> Amazing, amazing trip though. We'll come back. See you soon. Catch you next week. <laughs>